Okay, this is going to be a quick video on how to join the MediQuest PTC Early Access Program, PTC or Public Test Cluster is, I believe, the official term, or Public Test Channel, how, how they're using it. Cluster, channel, either way. So, here's how you do it. To sign up for eligibility, which I believe is not like a guaranteed access thing, but to sign up for eligibility, which I believe it said somewhere in the TOS that they reserve the right to cancel at any time. Well, basically, on your phone, keep in mind, this is on your phone. You want to tap the, you know, this symbol. Some call it a hamburger. Some call it the lines in the corner, settings, whatever you want to call it. Menu at the top of your Horizon feed. Again, this is on the app on your phone or iPad, I guess, but really on your phone. It's not on here because there is a Horizon feed on here, but yeah. And then you want to tap devices, select the headset you want to find to join the MediQuest PTC with. Now, keep in mind, this will be a headset that you have connected. So you got to make sure you have your headset connected to the app, which you should be able to hit connect device and go through all that. They actually made it very easy these days. So yeah, I believe you can connect with QR codes and whatnot these days. Don't call me on that though. So yeah, not sure how that entirely works. And then once you make sure that you tapped the device that you want, go to headset settings, then tap advanced settings, tap the toggle next to public test channel to try to join the MediQuest PTC. If the toggle does not work, MediQuest PTC is currently full and not available. Keep in mind, MediQuest PTC is offered on first come first serve basis. We do not currently have a wait list, so please check back at a later time if you're unable to sign up. Report issues or bugs on the MediQuest PTC. You can actually report issues all together by the report bug section from your headset. You can visit the forms for questions. Or oh, it says if you're experiencing an issue that needs immediate support, contact customer support. To remove yourself, you'll go through the same options and then toggle again. It says removing yourself from the PTC will stop you from receiving further PTC updates. You will stay on your current PTC version until a newer public release version is released. If you remove yourself, you may not be able to enroll if the program is at its capacity. So if you decide you want to remove yourself and then a day later rejoin, you might not be able to if it's at capacity. But it looks like from reading that it might be a the longer the room, you can remove and add yourself at any time type thing. But yeah, hopefully that helps you if you want to get into the MediQuest PCT, PTC or Public Test Channel, their early access program as it were. And with that said, I will catch you guys in the future. Later.